Wales is no forgotten land. The sound was never lost, just hidden for a time while it rested from the years of carrying such glories. But it's true, we've changed. Forged into a shape that doesn't resemble what went before because it's something more, an open door. We are not bruised by a lost revival. We are still standing in the faithfulness of the Lord and we will not be moved. While we remember what has gone before, we take the stories and spin our poetry upon it. But our sound remains in the now as it did back then. Heart full, heart true. You see, we were never absent. We've just been underground and at some point we will be found. But for now, know this. This anointing is no surface material. This is the, oh, the deep, deep love of Jesus. The mine from which the Welsh glory is dug. Gold and more gold to be found from the depth of a well of bread that never went stale, but has been refined and sweetened, broken for friends. That's who we are now, a land of friends where ministry isn't the pinnacle of a God-lived tapestry, but friendship that is woven silk of the sound from our heart. The sound of wheels you hear now is not through the organ, a voice or drums, but through the heart of a people who love. So Wales is no forgotten land. It's just been growing the seed of love, his love, playing the strings of the heart of Jesus is how people will get saved. Not just through the pleasure not you and a melody there, but in every good thing that displays who he is in the most beautiful of ways, whether it be a hymn or a song a prayer or the simplicity of just being a friend. So listen up. The new sound of Wales is this. Whatever is Jesus magnified and glorified and lifted high in the smallest and biggest ways in me, you, us, together. This is what you hear from this day on. The sound of wheels is the love for all.